Damn it. I told you. I already told you it wasn't me, man. Man, come on. I told you like like 20 times. I don't even I don't even know your brother. Clear up, son? What am I, the traffic man? Supposed to have been at the pen an hour ago. What's your problem, get man? Up for this. Well, relax. It's not your fault. What the hell, man? What? You know. Cut it out. Jesus, you guys. You gonna make me? Yeah. Hey, Vince! Justin's gonna make me! It's too hot for this shit. Vince! I'm making him hot now! Oh, shit! Come on, Vince. Hey, man. How about you open a fucking window? It's a prison bus, asshole. The windows hey, don't Justin, open. Hey, Justin, see right, that guy man. in the beat-up truck? Ain't right. I'll bet Shut he lives in that there. truck now. You probably got his whole house. Life savings. Shit. I bet you stole his dog. You steal his dog, man? I wasn't stealing from guys like that. Anyway, better than stealing his virginity. Hey. How many times I gotta tell you? Here we go. Seriously, I was falsely accused. How old was she, 15? Damn it, it ain't like that. You telling me there wasn't a star witness waiting around in your white van? I'm shocked. You were convicted, Danny. You gotta admit that much. Oh, come on, Vince. That don't mean I did it. My lawyer's gonna be hearing tell about this. Tell you what, this. guys. I ain't afraid to say it. When he I'm hears about really this. missing my girlfriend right now. I'm, I'm guessing she's pretty pissed nerve, at you. Man. It's worse swear, than that, man. She won't talk to me. Mouth. Haven't heard her voice in months. Really messing with me, like for real. Just let it go, man. I want to, but you know. I love her, man. You should call her up when we get there. You gotta face that shit. You know, you're right, man. First call I get. Danny, I know you don't realize this because you're you. But you probably ruined that poor girl's life, you piece of shit. Big talk from White Collar back there. How many lives you wrecked, kid? Who cares? Hotter than hell up in here. I'm getting dehydrated. Hey, how about some water back here? Shut I up thought you back took the there. stand and cried your eyes out. I'm telling you again. Didn't you lose your yeah, shit man, and tell them you didn't know what you were up, doing? Or I'll set you I up. lied. Turns out I'm good at that. You lied on the stand? See, that's the kind of shit I could never do. Religious? No, man. Watch a lot of cop shows? I gotta admit, I'd say anything to get out of doing more time. You guys are messed up. Says the criminal. You wanna know the funny thing? I don't regret any of it. I carried my victims for years. They knew what they were getting into. And now here I am, and there they are. And Wall Street assholes pulling the same scores are smiling on TV. Fuck that. How did it all work, anyway? It was like, uh... A pyramid scheme. Fuck Wall Street. Fuck Wall Street. Fuck Wall Street. How much did you make off with, anyway? Enough. So, like, a couple hundred K? A little over a hundred. Million. God damn, boy! Ho-ho! When we get out of here, you, me, and Vince, we gotta go into business, know what I'm saying? You know, I don't actually know a thing about you, Vince. Maybe he's a priest. Yeah, Father Vincent. I'm innocent. Give me a fucking break, man. Like you can talk? Yeah, but Vince is full of shit. I know he did something. That's just weak. So what was it, man? Must have been something real stupid, huh? Yeah, I did something. Well, that's specific. What the fuck are you gonna do about fuck it? Fuck you! Fuck me? <laughs> fuck you, motherfucker! 
Oh, oh shit! Oh, man. Christ. What the hell is going on, Crab man? Crabtree, knock it off! Hey, get in there, man! Got? Sit down, goddammit! Hey, let him go, man! That Damn it, Crabtree! Don't make me come that? back He's here now! He's gonna kill him, Vince! Let the guard handle it, guys. Fuck that! We gotta get in there! You do not want to get in the middle of that shit, Danny. I knew you didn't have any balls. I'm not doing any more time to save some stupid ass. Let the guard handle it. Come on, man! Crabtree, I'm warning you one He's last time, goddammit! You, you gotta get, you get, get in, in there! Get yourself in there and break that shit up, Come on, now. man! Come on, boy! Get back there! Okay, asshole. Let him go! Get in between them, goddammit! He's gonna kill that boy! Crabtree? Last what warning! Knock him out! Go, goddammit! What the fuck was that? Fuck. Jesus. What happened? What did you do, boy? God damn it, boy! Damn. Answer me back That guy's there. still alive! Get those cuffs off him, man! What the hell was that? He... he made a move on me! I, I... I don't know! He made a move? Or you don't know? Which one? He's still breathing? He's, uh... Fucking fuck! You gotta call someone, man! What? I'm calling this in. Don't. Don't call it in yet. Just... just wait, okay? Just give me a damn minute! You killed that guy! You gotta deal with it, man! I just need a minute! I need a minute to think. You ain't got a minute. Shut up, you hear me? Just shut your mouth! Okay, okay. Calm down. Take it easy. Somebody do something. You really want to pull that trigger again, son? Thanks, man. What the fuck? Did you see that? I saw it. Yeah. Hey, you gotta get us the hell out of We're here, We're not man. going anywhere! Fuck that! Get this bus moving! Hey, driver! I said let's go, we're man! We're staying right here! We're safe inside the bus! Nothing's gonna- Holy shit! Jesus! Oh my god. Hey. Hey! You need to call someone, you hear me? We need to- Did he just bail on us? Oh, Jesus. What the hell, man? Back up, back up! Fuck! 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 He can't reach us. Are you sure about that? That ankle's gonna get him. Shit! You gonna help out here, Vince? Come on! We gotta do something! I'm trying to think. Find a weapon. What kind of weapon do you think you're gonna find back here, asshole? Where's the guard's gun? Yeah, yeah, the gun! Good thinking, Justin! Where the fuck is it? I think he fell on it. It's underneath him. Oh, fuck me! Get the gun, man! Get up, Vince! Hurry up! Can't... Shoot this asshole, Vince! Do it! Oh! Watch it, man! Sorry. I'm sorry. Man, I can't believe this shit. Can you believe this shit, man? No. We gotta find some way to get out of here. God damn it. Pointless. We should just wait for help. Whoa, whoa, watch it. Ain't gonna work. Where are the damn keys, man? They weren't on him. Well, shit, if the keys aren't on him, then where the hell are they? He must have left them up front. Maybe we finally caught a break. Danny, Hey, don't. buddy! What the fuck? God damn it, Danny. You always put your fucking foot Fuck you, man. We gotta get out of here before any more of them show up. That's not gonna hold. Vince! Fire the fucking gun! Ugh. 
I think you just pissed them off. Yeah. Yeah, save the shells. Need those keys. Come on, Vince. Yeah. Won't budge. How the hell are we gonna get out There's of here? There's gotta be a way. Can't we just shoot off the chains? No way. Wouldn't cut through. What about the cuff? If we shoot one of those off, the chain will slip right out. Are you fucking insane? What do you think is gonna happen if you fire a shotgun that close to someone's foot? Well, what do you think's gonna happen if we don't get the fuck out of here? Vince, give me the gun. We gotta do this. Back off. Vince! What the fuck? I'm sorry, man. Fuck you! Do it! Hurry! Justin's just gonna slow you down. Do it again! Come on, let's go! Hey, Shell, your sister's getting pretty good, huh? Becca had a good teacher, Steph. Thank you for doing that. She needs something to focus on besides, you know, everything else. Yeah. Growing up in a world like this, what do you think that does to a kid? She's already changing. She dismisses things she cares about so easily. I guess you kind of have to when you've already lost so much, but I still worry. Becca's a good kid. These are shit times, and she's gonna go through that. But if we can keep her from experiencing some of the shit I've seen... Thanks, Stephanie. Thanks. Becca, that was great. Thanks, sis. You think we can do something like this every week? As long as it doesn't distract from keeping this place safe, that's always the priority. That was amazing, Becca. We could all use a little more music in our lives. Did I ever tell you that I used to play in a band? Yes, Roman, you've told us. She doesn't want to hear about it again. All right, all right. In that case, let's get back to work. Oh, and thanks to Boyd's hard work on the vegetable garden, we're having fresh soup tonight. Okay, let's get to it. You want to help me and Shell do the supply inspection? Cool. You check the flashlights this time. I'll look over the guns. Uh-uh. I don't want you messing with those unless we're in danger, okay? I'll take care of those later. Fine. Shell, when you get a sec, meet me out back. Help me feed the watchdogs. Sure thing. Eesh. These knives are looking pretty ragged. Don't worry, they're on our list. How are we doing on ammo? Better than we thought. We haven't had to use these for a while. You guys need help? Nah, we got this. Right, Becca? You go ahead and help Roman out back.
The diner looked pretty nice back then. That's because they used to pay people to clean it. Also, not as many dead visitors back then. Looks weird in here without the paintings. Well, Boyd wanted something to paint his own pictures on. I guess it'll be a personal gallery in here when he's done. Hey, Becca, think we should start charging for the inspections we make? Oh, yeah. Then we can spend all our money at nowhere. We should do an inspection on these. Make sure they all work. God, what I wouldn't give for a cup of coffee in the morning. This hasn't worked in a long time. Glad we thought to bottle our water before it ran out. Oh, you scared me! He's hungry. I guess he knows it's feeding time. It's not an animal, Roman. Well, it's not human either. Not anymore. You know, uh, your sister said she wouldn't mind doing this. Roman, we've talked about this. Becca doesn't need to deal with this kind of thing. Listen, I know you think that giving her an easy life is what's best. But it's really not. This is far from an easy life, Roman. You know what I mean. She needs to know the sacrifices we have to make to survive in this world. As long as she knows how to protect herself, it's fine. I don't want her to stop caring about people. Okay. What's that, Winnie? I don't know. I'll check it out. I gotta get back out front. Looking forward to that soup. Again. Whoa! What's your problem? I do this all the time. You don't get all pissed off. <sighs> you just... You can't go jumping out at people. Not anymore. It's not safe. But... What if I had a weapon? I could have thought you were a walker. What are you talking about? I... <sighs> Look, I... I just saw our walkers out back eating a, a puppy. A puppy? Yeah. I guess it just got to me. You know, it was... it was so little. You don't think about babies anymore, but... after a while you just kind of accept this is it. Yeah. I guess you kind of forget. <laughs> right? But then, you know, there it is. You see it and you want to protect it and... And now it's gone. That sucks. Maybe if Clive dies next, we can put him out there instead. He'd make a better watchdog anyway. Becca. Shell! Becca! Something's going on outside! What is it? I don't know. Something bad. We gotta find Roman.
Come here, everyone. Shit. Come on, we gotta find Roman. Let's mop them. If so, can be fair. Jesus. Largum. My God. Largum. What did you do? All I did was put on the blindfold and bind his wrists. Somebody else beat him up. He already had the cuts and bruises. Watchdogs caught him trying to steal supplies. Is he bitten? No. They didn't get that close. Did he hurt anyone? No, thank God. Who is he? I don't know. And I don't think he speaks English. I can't believe he just snuck the in. second break-in we've had in the last couple of weeks. Last time we couldn't catch him. And they got away with more medicine than we could afford to lose. Well, we all know what it's like trying to survive out there. He just came in here for food. Let's just give him some and send him on his what way. What if there are more of them? He could have been scouting. That's right. He could be part of a larger group. If there were more, I think we would have seen them by now. We can't take the risk of letting him go, but why not let him stay? I guess that would be okay. We could always use more hands keeping the place secure. Boyd, we don't need any more people here. And look at him. How is he he gonna... can't even speak English. This group works because we know how to communicate. At least if he stays here, we can keep an eye on him. Well, he's not staying here. You let in a stranger, and everything starts breaking down. The last time we did that, we lost Bree. And then Vernon with that goddamn boat. And all because some stranger lied and told us he had medicine. Can't trust nobody. I agree. Keeping him here is not an option. In his condition, he'd be a drain on our resources. Look, we all know what we're talking about here, so let's stop dancing around it. We either let this guy go and take our chances, or we kill him. Jesus Christ, are you serious? Roman's right. It's gotta be one or the other. We're letting him go. It's the only right thing to do. I'm telling you, we can't do that. But killing him? Is that really the answer? Stephanie, Boyd, you two don't think we should kill him. We know where Joyce and Clive stand on the subject. You're the swing vote here, Shell. What's it gonna be? We have to set him free. We can't. He's not even armed. We can't just kill him. This isn't in self-defense. Isn't it, though? If it means he can't come back to hurt us? That isn't the same thing. But last time... Joyce, that was a long time ago. If we kill this man, then we're giving up a part of ourselves that we can never get back. I'm not ready to let that go. Cut him free. I hope you guys know what you're doing. Give him some food, three or four cans, just as a gesture of good faith. Get him out of here. I don't know if you can understand a word I'm saying, but you better understand this. You came this close to death today, and if you ever, ever come near this place again, or tell anybody where we are, you wish you had died today. Do you have any fours? Nope. Do you have any sevens? Yep. I miss playing guitar for everyone. It was stupid, but fun. Why don't we do that anymore? Since the attack, there's a lot we don't do anymore. I shouldn't have let that guy go. Boyd would still be alive and everything would be the same. Boyd agreed it was the right thing to do. Anyway, Roman's obsessed with keeping this place secured now. You know that's impossible, right? Well, after last time. 
Roman isn't taking any chances. Then he should fix the loose board behind the storage lots. Becca, are you sneaking out again? Did anyone see you leave? No, no one saw me. You've got to stop doing that. You're going to get us both in a lot of trouble. I don't see why it's such a big deal. We had another break-in just last month. Uh, Becca, you know what it means if someone were to see you and follow you back here. No one is following me. There's no one else out there. Shell, I need to talk to you. It's open. What's going on? Hey, Becca. Hey. When you uh, get a sec, I need you to come out and talk to me. It's important. Okay. I'll be outside. You'll see me. We can talk here. No. Just finish up here and come find me. And don't take too long. What was that all about? I don't know. Probably not good, though. Stay here. It'll be just a minute. I'll fill you in when I get back. Joyce, do you know what's going on? I don't know if I should say anything. Please, what is it? They caught Stephanie stealing, and then trying to escape. Oh my god. What are they gonna do? I don't know. What can we do? I'll go talk to Roman. We'll figure it out. Roman? Good. You're here. I heard about Stephanie. I'm sorry. What are you gonna do? You know what we do. What happened? We caught her trying to escape. Maybe she wasn't. Maybe she just wanted to get outside these walls for a while. Ever since the incident, you've made this place feel, I don't know, oppressive? We've made it safe. She was definitely trying to escape. She had most of our ammo and medicine with her. She screwed us, Shell. All of us. And now we're in that position again where we can't keep her here and we can't let her go. You do know why I'm telling you this, right? Yeah. You want me to take care of it. You and Boyd were the ones who fought to let that guy go. Convinced us all to take that chance. Well, we did. And it was wrong. And now Boyd is dead. We're beyond the luxury of taking chances now. And I need to know that you're with us a hundred percent. But she's one of us. Th this is different. No, she's not. Not anymore. She tried to sneak out and leave us without any medicine or extra ammo. She knew that could mean the death of any one of us. You got your gun? It's in the camper. I'll give you a few minutes to get your head together. God, what do I tell Becca? That's up to you. Whatever you say, I'll back you up. Shell? What's wrong? Am I in trouble? It's... it's nothing. Nothing you have to worry about. Shell, just tell me. Someone was caught trying to steal our supplies. Who? Stephanie. Oh my god. What the hell did she do that for? Roman says we have to... Kill her? Yeah. Why would she do this to us? Doesn't matter. 
She did what she did. Stupid. Roman wants me to do it. I'm sorry. Let's just get it over with. Your gun's over there, in the drawer. You know, we don't have to do this. We can just go. What? We've survived on our own before. If we just go, we can be out of here before anyone can do anything about it. Are you crazy? Where would we go? There's nothing out there. As long as we're here, we're safe. The group will protect us. But for how long? I don't know. Longer than we'd survive out there. Besides, you know the rules. If we try to leave, Roman will hunt us down. We don't have a choice. This is who we are now. I don't want this to be who we are. Just let me do it then. No, I'll do it. You shouldn't ever have to do something like this. I just need a second. This really sucks. Yeah, it does. Shell, it's time. We gotta do this now. What are you doing? Shell? Shell, what the hell? Sit down, get safe. Shell, hey! Shell, be safe. No, no, no. Why the hell did you shoot that guy, man? What the hell was that? I didn't mean to do it. It just happened, okay? Where the fuck were you with a warning? Me? You're putting that on me now? I didn't see the guy either. I was too worried those dudes were gonna pull guns on us. Shit! Dude, how they catch up to us? Who gives a shit? Just... Hurry up, ready! Here, man. Shoot! Dude, get him, man! Jesus. there or not? Come on! Wyatt, talk words at me, man! Maybe they crashed? I didn't hear a crash. Did you hear a crash? No. No, I didn't. Here, here. I'll turn off. Feel that look on me, man. I'm not being an asshole. I'm being smart. No lights, no, uh, you know, they can't see us. Christ, I can taste blood in my mouth. I don't think it's mine. I can't see a damn thing out here. Crashing into a cow ain't gonna help anything, Oh, man. shit! I should watch out for cows. Cows! Why didn't I think of that? When's the last time you saw a cow, dude? Okay, bad example, but you could still hit something, man. Don't barf just yet, okay? Please, this road is really straight. We'll be fine. At least slow down. What? 
Fuck no. Did you see that one guy's eyes, man? He's fucking gorked. I don't want that guy in my life, Wyatt. Dude, you are covered in that guy's blood. I know, Wyatt. My shirt is soaked. It's like, I just... Why didn't they say anything? Guy's taking his shit over there. That's all they had to say. I told you not to keep that gun on you. Fuck right off, Wyatt. Those guys were going to kill us and take all our shit. You don't know that. Yes, I do. That gun saved your chubby ass. Look, Wyatt, all I know is those guys had me all jacked up like I was on speed or something. I was just on edge, you know? Then I was like watching that guy's brains come out of the back of his head. Sorry, man, I... Well, thanks for getting us out anyway. About time. I will punch your eyes. See? It's fine. Road straight as my dick. You think we're in the clear? We're probably fine. We don't even know where we are. Yes, we do. We're in the middle of the hills have eyes. The hills have lips. The hills have balls. Balls have eyes? The... What the fuck are you talking about? Dude, leave me alone. It's been a long night. <laughs> All right, let's Tom Cruise out of here. Why is it that you never had a girlfriend again? Oh, right. Forgot there was more than one reason. See if there's still any sticky in the glove box. Wyatt, come on, man. Check the glove box. I don't see anything. Dude, it's in there. Look harder. I don't see it. What I do see is that ammo that you lost last week. Oh my god, really? But is there any weed? You know, one time I was going out with this girl, right? Abigail. You remember her? And she told me that when she was five, I think, her dad took her to the circus sideshow. They walked around for a while. I think loading the gun is probably more important right this second. Thanks. Okay. Weird, but okay. Shit! Ah! Holy shit, dude. Holy shit. Did you get a look? I think that was a guy. Wyatt, come on man, say something. Was that a dude or not? What the, the fucking fog. This night is so fucked, man. Wyatt, talk, Wyatt. Do you have to be so damn thoughtful all the time? Have an opinion. Let's see if there's anything around the car. You know, anything that'll like tell us one way or the other. That way we can just book. But I'm not leaving if we hit a human being, man. I'm just not. Man, don't roll it down broken. I can't see through the cracks. Look, it's fine, see? Dude, what's that on the broken side mirror? It's part of his shirt, I think. Yeah, but plenty of dead guys have shirts on. Keep looking. You think that blood on the windshield is fresh? Or is that the mirror from the car? Can't tell from here. What's that way out in the road? Seriously, you think some piece of that guy made it into the glove box? Man, I don't know. Man, I'm really not seeing anything. Man, don't look at yourself. This is serious. I wasn't. Whatever, man. Keep looking. Look, Wyatt, it was a guy. Are you sure? Yes. How sure? Pretty fucking sure. Don't pay for sex drunk, sure. Jesus. So what do we do? What do you mean, what do we do? We go out there. 
no way I'm getting out of this car. Forget it. What if that was you, man? After all this shit that's happened in the past couple months, where's your compassion, motherfucker? Come on, man. This is stupid. We go out there, we check it out, we get moving. You go if you want. Want? Why would I want to? I just... We just have to. That's all there is to it. Okay. Well... Shit, okay. Here, we'll rock, paper, scissors for it. Are you fucking serious? No. Come on. Sitting here is making me nervous. Man, I can't believe I'm doing this shit. Dude, two seconds, it's over. All right, two out of three, right? Sure. One, two, three, go. Fuck! What are the chances of that? Okay. One, two, three, go. Shit, man. <laughs> Insane. Okay. Again. One, two, three, go. Man. Okay. All right. One, two, three, go. Oh. Paper. Should have known you'd pick paper. All right, dude. This is it. One, two, three, go. Damn, man. Killed those scissors. Son of a bitch. All right. I got this. Be careful, dude. I'll just keep talking to myself out here because that makes sense. Hey man, you okay? Wyatt, do you see anything? Fella? You need to answer me, man. If you're a dude, I don't want to shoot you. Oh, shit. Are you okay? Uh, sir? Can you, can you hear me? Damn it, man, are you gonna be alright? Fucking help me out! Looks like he's pretty out of it. Okay, uh... Sorry, dude. Got to split.
gotta help me, man. Eddie, there was a guy. I'm in trouble. Come help me out. Eddie, come on. I'm too fat for this. Come on, man. It was just getting started. Okay, got one. A snake for a tongue. You're so bad at this. Would you rather have a snake for a tongue? Awful. Or lobster claws for hands? I swear, this is the worst one ever. You know the rules, miss. Gotta answer. Well? I'm thinking. Think harder. And how exactly do you think harder? Both. Both? The whole point of the game is to choose. But they're both such attractive options. Yeah, you got me there. Okay, how about... Oh, never mind. I probably ought to stop bugging you with stupid hypotheticals. Oh, come on. You'd be a lot less fun. You've been a lot more fun lately. Feeling better? I guess I am. Well, you sure do look better. Though, uh... You gotta admit, anything is an improvement. That came out wrong. What I mean is... I mean, uh, you were... You were, uh... You know. Take a hike, big ears. I resemble that remark. You resemble a satellite. You know, you weren't so damn sassy before. Guess that's a good sign. I mean it, though. After we found you, you were still so hooked on that stuff. Well, I never thought you'd make it. You ain't out of the woods yet, I know, but well, you've come a long way, Bonnie, and I'm proud of you. Oh, shut up. What are you, my sponsor? I'm the best you got. God help me. Look, you know I ain't going nowhere, right? As long as we're together, I'll be there for you. You ain't gotta worry. You know that, right? I know. God, Leland... Thank you. Bonnie, I... Leland? Bonnie? D. Hey, honey. I found us something. What are you two up to? Just chatting. Chatting, huh? What about? You, actually. Oh? Uh, what about me? I was just telling Leland here how grateful I am. You know, for you guys helping me out. Really? I got you a present. Oh, you shouldn't have. What'd you find? I'll tell you later. I don't mean to interrupt your chat with your uh, girlfriend, but uh, we gotta get moving. What the hell was that? So, where'd you get the bag, Dee? Dee? Dee, did you hear me? Keep up the pace, you two. Let's keep moving. I feel like I've been in a washing machine all day. I'd kill for a towel right now. Or a blow dryer. <laughs> yes, good lord, deliver us a blow dryer. Hey, Dee, when we get back to camp, would you let me borrow some of that nail polish? Sure, hon. You like this color? It's my favorite. And after today, I could use a new coat, you know? Same here. I feel like a drowned rat with these claws. Not to interrupt a girl talk here, but, uh, D, that, that bag. Look, I found it down the road a piece, all right? Where down the road? Quit being so cagey about it. Me? Cagey? You two are the ones being cagey. Calm down, D. Just tell us where you found the bag. You guys sure gang up on me a lot lately. Honey, that ain't true. Tell me one time you sided with me in the last week. The last month. All right. I can't remember one especially, but I know I have. False. 
This is how all our fights go, every time. Now we're standing here in the woods, soaking through, and for what? Don't you want to get to the camp before dark? I ain't the one who stopped. But you are the one who made me stop. Irregardless, we could just as easy carry on like this while we're walking. Oh, I've about had it with that attitude. Attitude? And now we're standing in this goddamn rain, in this goddamn middle of nowhere place. I know you did that on purpose. You listen to me now. I have had it up to here with listening to you. I can't believe you are still religious after what we've been through. My something I wear like a fucking sweater. Don't just take it off when it gets uncomfortable. Bonnie, darling, I'm I'm sorry we're Darling! D, come on. Save it! I know what side your bread is buttered on. Yours too. D, now's not the time. What are you saying? You know exactly what I'm saying. Well, come on now, D. No reason to pick a fight. I'm sorry. I just want to get somewhere where I can change my clothes, and then you and your girlfriend can. Oh no. Oh god, run, come on, we gotta move. What are you talking about? Oh shit. Son of a- oh! Where are you? I don't see shit out here. Where are you? Dev, you see something? Come on, Bonnie. Come on. Anything? No, I can't see a damn thing out here.
over me. Okay, Bonnie. Stay calm. Find a weapon. for me. Okay, Bonnie. Stay calm. Find a weapon. for me. Okay, Bonnie. Stay calm. Find a weapon. did this. Oh, God, you killed me. You, you killed me. Anybody see anything? I should it's never have dark out here. trusted you. Just... Just a junkie. I... God, I'm so sorry. So... I can't... Oh, God, God! I knew you'd fuck up again. Take him. I... I... No, God, I'm sorry. I need him. I need you both. You... Bitch. Mary, you wanted him. Didn't... Thank you. Had the stones. Dee, I would never... I swear this has nothing to do with him. It was an accident. You fucking junkie. Spread out. It can't be far. Dee! D, did you find her? Bonnie, I, I thought they got you back there. Jesus, are you shot? D, oh God, what happened? Oh, Jesus, oh, Lord, Bonnie, what happened? Oh, my God, D. Arlena, what happened to you? It doesn't matter now, Leland. She's dead. We've got to move on. We can't stay here. I know, but just give me a minute. Tell me what happened. 
I, I found her like this. I should have been there for her. I, I'm sorry, Leland. I don't buy it, Bonnie. I don't buy it at all. Back this way! Oh, I no, feel sick. Which way? There! Call out if you see him. I think I heard something over here. Leland, come on. I ain't leaving her. I need you, Leland. You're all I got. Leland! Shouldn't have maybe taken so many cans. Hey! You getting up? Good. I should probably hurry. Shit, shit, shit. I see you cuddling with your girlfriend down there. Shit, bro. I don't want no trouble. Please. You just want to be left alone with your friend down there? No, just leave me alone. Look, I don't care what you do to whatever corpse you find. I wasn't. What's your name? Russell. So you didn't steal that bag. I don't care who you steal from, if you did. Maybe you're in a gang that likes to rob people. I don't know. Are you in a crew? You got some boys wearing hoodies I gotta worry about? Mine. I didn't steal it. All right, good. I don't like food. Just get in the car. You're gonna get eaten out here otherwise, and I'm bored. Come on. Scoot. Ain't gonna wait forever. Okay. Yeah. I'd like a ride. That'd be good. Thanks. Hell yeah! Get in! Let's tear it up! I'm trying to get to my grand's house. Fuck, she like the party? Just get in. We'll get there. Or somewhere. Eventually. <laughs> Name's Nate, by the way. Thanks for asking. You thirsty? Uh... Here you go. I'm straight, thanks. You're not uptight, are you? Is this the fucking apocalypse? This is like... nothing. No, I'm just good, alright? Alright, alright. You wanna tell me about where you come from, at least? You must have been with a crew. Any tail back where you come from? Maybe drop you off, do a double back. K. 
Can we just drive? We? Oui. You want to sit on my lap? I just don't want to talk. You're a tough little nut, Russ. Look, man, I'm sorry if I freaked you out at first. We all got our way of coping with shit, right? I guess I can come across a bit... Ah, whatever. Guess. There you go. Relax. We're gonna have some fun. Why don't you tell me where you were before you got here? Fine. There was seven of us. I didn't have any family there or nothing. They were all at my grand's down in Statesboro. There was a dad who had a daughter about my age. One guy said he used to be a cop, but nobody really believed him. Then a teacher and his wife. The leader was this guy, Steve. Go back to the daughter. Steve was a bad dude, but everybody was with him, you know? He said seven was the magic number, so we didn't add nobody to the group. If we found survivors, it was the same every time. He... he... Let it out, Paco. Just... We gonna kill these folks and take this stuff or what? Then bang! They'd be dead. Anyway, I, I couldn't handle that. Weeks of it, I packed my shit up and figured I could make for Grands alone and try to find my family. I slipped out of there. I couldn't live like that. So nobody got down with the daughter then? No, they didn't. What would you give her? Strong six? Just tell me something about her. How was the rack? Give me a little something. Just a taste. Russ, I'm doing you a service here. I gotta get my beak wet. I put it right in here. Sure, whatever. Sure, whatever? Come on. All right, maybe someone who wasn't so near and dear to your heart then. What the fuck? Come on, scale of one to ten. What do you think? Ah, slamming before she was rocked, right? What do you think? Here, get a look. Fuck! Like a nine, right? Get off me! Maybe you got high standards. Hell, help! If you say five, I'm gonna flip. Tell me, Russ! Jesus, Russ, calm down! Damn it! Would you load that? Bullets in the glove, then. Let's look for some supplies in here. See if we can fill up while we're at it. Don't be mad. Fine, be mad. Just stop being a pussy. Alright. Oh shit! Go! Get out! Russ! Get the fuck down, man! You don't want to be there! Get to the truck! I'll cover you! You got bullets this time? Don't think about it, just run! I'll keep his fucking head down! Good hustle. What happened to- I'll cover you! Look how good you did. I don't know, man. Fuck, we're screwed. You haven't been shot at in three months? Come on, kid, look at me. This is no big deal. We got this, okay? Okay. First, we're gonna figure out exactly where this asshole is. Just get a quick glance. Come on. 
just a peek. He won't hit us. Come on. I'm not fucking with you this time. Let's do this. Russell, come on! See? Easy. Now we know where he is, we can fucking get him. All right. Yeah. That's the spirit. Let's push this truck for cover. Okay. It's in neutral. Just keep your head down. Shit! Just keep pushing! the side of the building. We gotta go from cover to cover. Seriously this time. I'm not fucking around. Yeah, no problem. Easy as pie. Just don't get shot. If we get to that car, we'll be out of the line of fire. Here. You can cover me first. I'm not fucking around. You cover me, then I'll cover you. Or if you want to go first, that's fine too. I'll go first. Had a boy, Russ. Haul ass. All right, I'm good. Heads up. Nice. Start shooting, I'm coming. Ah, come on. As soon as you start shooting, I'm coming. Get over there and we should be good. Go! You crazy, man. Whatever. We got more work to do. Let's see if we can get in around back. Sneak up on this asshole. Follow me. Man, what are we doing? Well, we gotta get in there. Fucker shot at us. Russell, relax, man. When this is over, we're gonna take what we can, head on down to your grams, and have a big old home-cooked meal, all right? Come on. Okay, it's clear. Keep your head down and follow me. You got it. All right. We're gonna be fucking quiet. We're gonna sneak up on this son of a bitch and take him out. You hear me? Not a fucking peep. Let's go. I see him. Check through the window. See if there's anyone else. I think I saw a guy. No shit. Grab him. 
I'll cover you. Do I sneak up? Just jump out and grab it. Your call. Walt! Oh! Get the fuck out of here, you monsters! Whoa, Gramps! I told you not to come back here! Think you could just leave your mask at home? And now you're with this fucking spook! First off, watch the fucking racism. This is my boy. Secondly, I don't fucking know you. We were just passing by like anyone else. Bullshit! You came back to finish us off and take all our food! You've lost your goddamn marbles. She's dying, and now she can see your face. Mask? What's he talking about? Fuck if I know. He's crazy. Have you been here before? Russell, don't you start. You tried to kill us for no goddamn reason. If anything, we should take you out for that. Please, just get the fuck out of here! Please, leave us alone! What do you say, Russ? Should we just kill these folks and take all their stuff? I'm done. That's it, man. I don't know you, and I don't want to. Can't you take a fucking joke? Fuck your jokes. I'm sorry. I'm out. Come on. Can we still be friends? No. We were right. There are survivors out here. Still alive? Well, they're gonna be happy to get rescued. So how many are we talking about? I won't know for sure until I find them. Sure, sure. They left a note, so at least we know they want to be found. And I can see smoke in the distance. Probably a camp. I'm gonna try to make contact tonight. Great. Well, just be careful and use your best judgment. Of course. So good. I'm gonna try to talk to him. Wish me luck. Yeah, good luck. Be careful. Don't try to force him into anything. Just get as many of them as you can. You got it. Hey! Don't you- Bits! Don't fucking move! Who the fuck are you? My name is Tavia. How did you find us? It's what I do. I'm a scout for a growing settlement up north. We go out and look for survivors to rescue them. We have food, clean water, and shelter for everyone. We're offering you a chance to help us out and start over. God, this sounds too good to be true, but I think it is. Bonnie, get real. Just because she says it's true doesn't mean it is. You should know about that. Hey! What I told Leland- Cool it. I heard rumors about these places. This guy I was traveling with ditched me trying to find one in his own. He thought, you know what? Let's do this. She looks well fed, right? And clean? We could all use a meal and a hot shower. Hold up. We don't know what kind of people we're dealing with. I don't want to get stuck with some crazy asshole like Russell did. I walked away from that shit, Wyatt. And that dude was crazy from Jump Street. Look, we need people, plain and simple. You folks can decide if you want to come as a group, or split up, or whatever. 
but I don't want to be out here in the open after dark. So in a few minutes, I'm going to be getting back in my car and on my way. Hopefully, at least some of you will follow me. Well, I'm going. Maybe we should go too, sis. If Roman is still looking for us, he wouldn't be able to do anything to us there. There's no way that guy is still looking for you. We've been to that truck stop. There's no one left. Roman's not a problem. It's following her that'll get you killed. Look, I know it's a risk, but what else is there? If you guys are going, then so are we. I don't like this, guys. We should just walk away. I don't trust her. Well, why not, Russell? If they have food and medicine and... and... Yeah, medicine. Look... I don't trust her, Bonnie. Then stay here if you want. I'm not bringing anyone against their will. We only want people who want to be there. Guys, trust me. We need to get to this place. Well, it could be a trap. What if they want to kill us? Thank you. Everyone out there is batshit crazy. We've all seen it. Well, we turned out all right, didn't we? If we wanted to kill you, you'd be dead already. I had a gun and snuck right up. Well, what's stopping you? Exactly. Nothing. Look, I know you guys are wary, and you have every right to be. You don't know me from a hole in the ground. And yeah, there are some crazy fuckers out there. All I'm here to do is make an offer. You can come with me, or you can stay here. The choice is yours. So, who wants to come with me? Yeah, I'm going. I'm... I'm just not sure. We've been out here for so long and seen so much bullshit. I mean, is it really worth getting our hopes up? Of course it is, Russell. Hope is all we've got left. But being smart, that's what's keeping us alive. Some of you may have been separated from friends or family. It's a long shot, but there's a chance you could find them there. Have your people been through Statesboro? Yes, I think we have. Okay, but I swear to God, if you try anything, you're gonna regret it. Yeah, and if you're not lying, maybe... Maybe Eddie will be there. We'll do everything we can to help you find your friends and family. But understand that I can't promise anything. We understand. I think we've all made up our minds. Well, I guess we have our group. What do you want to do with these? This is a good thing. I know it is. How do we know this will work out? I give you my word. 